So with that, we'll start our program with Edu. Welcome. Hello. Uh, I'll talk today to you about uh, cell phones. Cell phones are mobile devices. You take them anywhere. The only problem with uh, cell phones is that the information and the news that you have on your cell phones, they don't change. My name is Eduardo Quaroni, and I think we can do better. And doing better, we can create a new experience for users. Welcome to Flying Content a company that generates smarter content for smart devices, like your mobile phones, your smart watches, and you soon to be your connected cars. Uh, Flying Content will start as a consultant company, helping media partners and brands to create special projects that involve location. I'm also working on an automated solution to quickly geotag a client's content directly from its CMS. My expenses for the first year will run around $35,000, and, and the revenue after uh, 12 months will come from three to five clients. I'll give you now five very quick examples of how location can help the news. The first is example is about a museum. We as a class, we just ha have been to the Metropolitan for a special tour. And uh, when the tour finished, I think the confusion started because we had two more hours in the museum and we didn't know where to go because the museum is, is very big. So now the mat has beacons inside. So it's possible now to have a specialized tour if we have the, uh, the right content. We, in the right tour that, is, uh, that takes into account how much, uh, how much time you have, what are your interests, and how many times you've been to the mat before. Second example is about local news. Imagine if those companies, they could talk directly to users that were in the area of the, the fire in the Lower East Side. They could, them, they could give them uh, information about hospitals, about street closures, and about business that were affected by the fire. And when users, they start to receive those informations, they start to talk back, and then you can create uh, a better story for everybody. Third example is for big newspapers like the New York Times. Uh, they can use location for special projects. Uh, that's a story from 1904, it's about uh, how Times Square got its name, and I think it's fascinating, and if you receive that story when you're walking around the place, it has a, a totally different meaning, and a story such, such this becomes relevant again, and uh, you can create a new revenue for the newspaper. Imagine a, seri a series like uh, HBO's Sonic Highways. It's a series where the Foo Fighters visit uh, studios in eight American cities to show the music that was made there. If you're nearby one of those studios, you can receive a message, maybe a, a, a WhatsApp message from Dave Groban himself, explaining why those places are cool, what kind of music was done there, was recorded there, and uh, maybe you can uh, receive like a 30 second uh, audio clip. It has a totally different meaning. And uh, the last case is about a vertical site that uh, specializes in healthcare. Um, Imagine, and I hope that nobody needs to go to the emergency room, but imagine that if you do, you want to get help faster. So maybe you can have an app that you just push one big button, and then you receive, because the app knows where you are and know where uh, the emergency rooms are, takes into account the waiting times, and can actually uh, send you to the quickest place to get uh, help. It's, it's something very simple, but also very powerful. Uh, right now, I'm looking for contacts here and also uh, a, a business partner in New, in New York area. I have uh, 20 years of experience as, as a journalist, both in Brazil and here. In 2008, I started a project called Global Amazonia, where you could track forest fires in real time, and uh, the project was, uh, got uh, a great engagement in Brazil. More than 55 million people protest against the deforestation of the forests, and uh, if people care about the Amazon forests, Imagine how much more they care about what's going on around us. And um, don't think that location is something for the future. It's not. It's happening right now. Thank you very much.